everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you how you can take stamps and create a work of art using elements within the stamp. So for example, the main one I'm going to use for the project that I'm going to show you is this stamp here. Now, let's say, you know, maybe you just have always wanted to learn how to draw faces. And this is a great technique or a video to follow if you're wanting to learn how to draw faces better or if you just want to find ways to take some of your stamps that you love but you just kind of want to give it you know, a little twist or just some sort of different element and that's what I'm going to show in this video. So the project that I'm going to demonstrate is this one here. This is going to be a travel journal that I'm going to create and this is the cover that I did on canvas. And this is an example of how you can take this stamp but change it a little bit. And I show how I just made some simple little variations to this stamp to create a whole different image here. And so, you know, you can see where I took and I changed the hair up a little bit. And then I used this stamp here to, you know, add some elements as far as a collar, you know, taking the bottom portion of this stamp and then this section of this to create kind of like a ribbon barrette uh, element in her hair. I love to take and show ways to create art, but thinking out of the box, you know, in doing so. I just used a piece of canvas. I have my Caribou stamps here, of course. I decided to use the Nuvo Hybrid ink pad, and this ink will allow you to either use alcohol ink markers or uh, whatever mixed media you decide to use. So I'm using the Nuvo Hybrid ink pad, which I really like. And then I'm just using black and white paint. And I got these at Hobby Lobby. This is a great value if you go to Hobby Lobby and you're able to pick these up when they have them 50% off. So then you're getting these nice large tubes of paint. It's a thick body acrylic. And uh, for 10 bucks, you know, for a tube of paint, it's, it's a good value for the quality of paint that you're getting. And that's pretty much it. Oh, and then I did use some stickles in the end. So I hope you enjoy this video. It really allows me to challenge myself, uh, you know, my creativity and all of that. So I hope you, you know, get inspired. And, you know, if you could please leave a comment, let me know if you enjoy the video. If you think that you might try something like this, I would love to hear. And I will do a giveaway. So for any of you that leave a comment, you know, your thoughts on this, and if it's something you'd like to try, I will send you one of my stamps. I'll even autograph it for you. <laughs> and uh, I'll send you uh, the Nouveau ink as well. So there, there's a little giveaway here. Uh, be sure to watch the entire video, and at the end, leave a comment and let me know your thoughts. So I'll go ahead and I'll turn some music on, and I'll show you the demo of how I created this travel journal cover here.
trapping all the way from north to south. It's been a long time coming. It's been 